Lady Bucks working on a six and two start to the season and kicking off conference play in the friendly confines of home against Stetson. Ramey Kearns chasing a school record maybe this season and certainly looking to lead the high power Lady Bucks offense against the Hatters in the A-Sun opener into the first half. Well, an opportunity early after a foul uh, to Sarah Zadrazil sets up a free kick. Hannah Short able to get ahead to it, but just over the crossbar, trying to send one ahead for Ramey Kearns early on in the half. And uh, that time she's offside, but this time she's going to be in the right place, right time. Watch Short with the extra effort on the 50-50 ball. Gets it back to Morgan Thomas, who leaves the cross perfectly in the middle of the six-yard box for Kearns and worth another look. It's able to skirt a couple of defenders, and Kearns beats Victoria Tricoli to the back of the net to put the Lady Bucks up 1-0. Her 10th goal of the season and more where that came from. Still in the first half, though, nice through ball to Kearns, and she's able to get one onto the near post, but it is saved by Tricoli, so at halftime, still 1-0. International Day of Peace celebrated at the game as uh, members of the Model United Nations able to step back and just breathe a sigh of peace for a moment. Back into the fray, though, in the second half. This one down just outside the box. Lindsey Bickle able to shake her defender and get in, but that one deflected out for a corner. Five corners in the game for Lady Bucks. Kearns on goal and able to put in her own deflection. A little bit later on, Kearns with her third multi-goal game of the season. That in the 69th minute, she's one shy of a program record. Trying to tie it here. Tried to get a second hat trick and couldn't quite finish. Nice piece of work by the Lady Bucks to get her that one. However, Christy Davis would make it a three-goal night for the Lady Bucks with uh, that one to close it out 3-1 to one over Stetson from Summers Taylor Stadium. 